The table that Dine Kweme was shaking yesterday. The table that she scattered on her channel yesterday. Guys, I was on that table. And then I almost broke my waist. So today, I came back in this video with my carpenter. Sit down, relax, and watch. It's have an open mind and check out for my own point of view. Then please click the like button and share if this video made any sense to you. Welcome to Helene's Corner. So in that video, Dinah stated that if your subscriber count is hidden, if YouTube is not for you this year, that you should pack your things and go to the market. Uh, it's better you pack your things and go to the market. It's here a table, you know. <laughs> That's for those that understand Igbo. That it's better for you to pack your things, go to the market and buy things, spread on the table. At least people will be seeing it there. Immediately after she made that video, I saw a lot of people. They just rushed. Some of them, yeah, that hit their subscriber count. Most of them started opening their subscriber count. Okay. So I am here to tell you today that sus subscriber count is not the main measure of growth on YouTube. Yes, that is what I want to let you know today. My point is, if you check out my video, was it last month or so, you will notice that I was having videos of high views. I was having 2,000, 3,000 on most of my videos. Guys, immediately I started having all those views. My subscribers noticed that my views were going up. Some of them inboxed me and were like, wow, what, you're growing tremendously. I like your growth, different things. So that is to show you that it is, your subscribers don't even need to see your subscriber count to know that you're growing on YouTube. All they need to see is to see your views, okay? There are people that have 100,000 subscribers and yet on their views, you will see 1,000 views, 2,000 views, 5,000 views. The views is not simultaneous with the subscriber count they have. Hiding your subscriber count has nothing, absolutely nothing to do with your growth on YouTube. In most of the cases, okay, let me start today by introducing a specific channel that has hit her subscriber count right from when she was 1,500. She get just 100 views, highest 200 views, 50 views, 90 views, and today she make up to 10,000 views, okay, and people are subscribing to her channel, okay. So it is not because you hit your subscriber count that you are not growing, mm -mm. If you check it out, if you see when YouTube recommend videos to subscribers to watch, they don't really show them your subscriber count. No, they don't show them. They recommend the video, the thumbnail and the title for people to see, not the subscriber count. So it has nothing to do with your growth on YouTube, okay? Rather, some people might even go depressed when their subscriber count is not reading, as in when they are not doing well on YouTube, when they are not growing, they might even go depressed. Instead of seeing it as a reason to put in more effort, they, okay? I watched a very big YouTuber that do grow TV. His name is Nick. I follow him a lot. I've watched his YouTube video where he specifically said that subscriber count doesn't really matter for your growth on youtube that what matters is number one your title your title and your thumbnail these two things matters for your growth on youtube because this is the first thing the subscriber see before viewing your video now, after the person has seen the thumbnail and I see the title, one of the things will captivate him. Either the title or the thumbnail will be catchy and it will not capture him to now watch your YouTube. A subscriber might finish watching your YouTube self without even knowing how many subscribers you have or what you, whether you're growing or whether you're not growing, okay? They go to your channel and measure your growth according to views they see. That is why my subscriber will inbox me and say, Helen, look, your views are in drastically improving. What are you doing? What is your secret? Do you understand me? What has to do with your growth on YouTube is the content you make. Secret. Aside from title one, thumbnail two, the third secret of growth on YouTube is your niche. Your niche, niching down is very, very important. Okay, if you look at my growth on YouTube, if you go and look at my videos, last year there was a time I went out and did more of Abakaleki videos. 
Okay, okay. Will I call it last two years or it's still last year? Early last year, I went out. I was doing more of Abakaliki videos. I started growing. I will get up to 500 subscribers within a week, within two weeks. When I start doing other content like health, money, these are not the things my subscribers subscribed for. They don't watch it. And I'm putting all those things because I don't want tomorrow when I leave Ebony State or if anything happen, I'm no longer here or I'm, I go abroad, then my YouTube channel will become dormant. I've seen YouTubers, great YouTubers, that their content went viral because they are showing Enugu, Abakaliki. And when they left, and when they left Nigeria, they went to another country. They couldn't continue with their YouTube channel. Why? Because they even if they put videos, people don't watch it because this is not the kind of content people subscribe for. That is why as I'm making my videos, I put in those content people did not subscribe for. So that when I live here, it will not be difficult for me to get really pretty good views just because I was completely on my niche but if i decide today to face only abakaliki videos keep producing only ebony videos i'm gonna go viral beyond expectation that's what i want you to know okay i don't know how many of you watch lily or guinea if you watch Lily Ogini, you will see that of recent, her growth, she's growing very, very well. Take time and look at the videos she make of Ghana. Each time she talk about Ghana, Ghana is her niche. Each time she talk about Ghana, she gets view, massive views, okay? But whenever she talk about any other thing or Nigeria or any, people didn't subscribe to her channel because of Nigeria. Most of the people that subscribe to her channel subscribe because of Ghana. And that is why anytime she makes a Ghana video, she goes viral. Um... There is this uh, YouTuber I watch a lot, Kata YouTuber, Modest Lifestyle. She's my friend and my sister. If you go to her channel, you will see that when she makes some other videos, other content, her personal content, she doesn't really get views. But whenever she makes any reaction videos, it moves. Because reaction video is the reason people subscribe to her channel. Go straight to story of motherhood. Whenever she make other videos, she doesn't really get views. But when she make reaction videos and breastfeeding mother video, you will see that she goes viral with the views. If you go to Lily Pop, many people subscribe to her channel because of her family and prank. Whenever she make all those prank videos or those her, her village cooking video, you will see that her, she gets views. So... What you need to do if you really want to grow on YouTube, if you want to grow on YouTube, if your growth matters for you, if you're desperate for growth, if you just want to grow bomba to bomba, go straight to your analytics. Check your videos. Look for the videos that gave you the highest subscriber. You concentrate on that niche. So finally, consistency. If you're consistent, you upload video every day, every one or two days. Your subscribers will know you are serious. They will start following you. They will start following you. If they stay two days, they'll come and check you. If they stay one day, they'll come and check you. And that's how you go viral. But anytime, just watch yourself. No matter how far you've gone, anytime you stay like one month or two weeks without uploading videos on YouTube, watch your growth. You will start dropping. You will start dropping. Gradually, if you continue back to back or maybe every two days or three days, you will see yourself growing again. That's how it is on YouTube. So, in a nutshell, your title, your thumbnail, your, your, your niche, and then consistency matters more on YouTube than your subscriber count. It has nothing to do with your growth on YouTube. As a matter of fact, you don't watch a video from YouTube based on subscriber count. And you don't subscribe to a channel most often based on subscriber count. Some people even say that whenever they see that your subscriber count is even small, people find it difficult to subscribe to you. Because people tend to be attracted more to people that other people like. When I go to Diane Equipment, 100,000 subscribers, yes, there must be something she's doing. I will subscribe fast. But when I see 1,500, I might just be reluctant even to watch the video. Until you start making wave. 
so make good titles good thumbnails once you if you want open your subscriber account if you don't want close it let nobody push you into opening any subscriber account it has nothing to do with growth on youtube I am going to open my subscriber account. What I've told myself is when I read hit 10k. So if you want to see my subscriber accounts first, please take opportunity just this one minute. If you've not subscribed, subscribe and add to my growth. So guys, my advice for all Nigerian YouTubers today is don't be in a hurry to grow, like desperate to grow. No. If you're desperate to grow, you may end up spending more money than you should have, getting more enemies than you should have gotten. Yes, life, you have enemies, you have friends, but you will not create for yourself wealth of enemies because you will not be happy. This one is not helping me. This one is not supporting me. You will make enemies. And finally, worst of it all, you may even end up being depressed. Be contented with what you have. Most of all these big YouTubers you see out there, they suffered too before they got to where they are. Just keep putting in effort. Just make sure you're putting in effort. Make sure your today is better than your yesterday. One day, we all, we are going to go viral. One day, we all, we are going to grow. And if you believe, just drop amen on the comment section, guys. So, I have finally fixed that table. Sit down on the table. Be confident. It's not shaky. Bye. Love you. Thank you for watching Helen's Kana.